so in today's video i'll be showing you guys how to do the hairline of your lace so i already finished your other part and i'm going to be showing you guys how to do the hairline for the hairline what you want to know is that the amount of hair you carry or you take matters a lot because that's what's going to help you get the natural look of the hairline right so um if you've been taking our like two or three strands for the other part of the lace for the hairline you want to take just one strand of hair and also you'll be leaving more space than you left for the other parts of the hair right so now you can see that i'm just taking one strand and i'm not really cautious of the amount of holes i'm leaving because you want it to look as natural as possible so it depends on how um light or how or how dense you want the hairline to be for some persons they would like um the very light hairline especially when you're using the hd lace to ventilate the hd lace works very well with um very scanty hairline so when after you do your installation and everything it looks very very natural but you can also make it a bit dense so let me just give you guys like an idea on um how much space how much space you can leave to give the hairline a very natural look so you can basically just leave your normal one line like your normal um one line as you can see like this line and just leave one line and then you start ventilating so instead of leaving just one hole you can um leave about two holes in each line that you're ventilating okay so remember when while we're ventilating like normal parts we're leaving just one hole but for the hairline um we'll be leaving two holes instead of just one hole so leave one line and about two or three holes remember i said it depends on how dense or how um or sorry how dense you want the hairline to be you can choose to leave just two holes or choose to leave three holes right so let's paint it and see what the outcome is going to look like so remember we are picking just one strand of hair or you can also pick two strands of hair but it should not exceed two strands of hair as the not to be very very visible and it won't look as natural as you would want it to be so we are leaving one line and then we are leaving two to three holes so remember i leave one line and leave two to three holes And also remember that you are ventilating the line, sorry, the hole directly opposite the space you left in the previous, you left in the previous line, right? So you can see what this is looking like. So I'm just going to continue like this. You leave one line, then you leave two to three holes, and then you pick one to two strands of hair. So I'm just going to continue with this method and then come back to show you guys what the finished result looks like. This is what this is looking like on the skin. You can see how natural the hairline looks. So I just you can see this one. I think I accidentally picked more than two strands of hair. That's why this knot is the way it is here. So just um keep practicing with the method. One line, then two to three holes. 